Hey STEM families, it's Jessica, your tour guide for this awesome engineering design challenge. It is one of my absolute favorites. It's called the Candy Dispenser Challenge. This is a really fun one because there are so many different ideas you can come up with based on this challenge that we have for you. Today, your job is to create a machine that chooses a candy to dispense and travel down for you to enjoy. So when I did my research on this one, because that's the first part of the engineering design process, I actually went to my local grocery store and I got a couple gumballs for myself. So those candy machines actually use if you look at our resources in the module, they use what's called simple machines to dispense the candy after you put your money in and you turn the knob for it to come out of the machine. That's the idea with this challenge. As you can see, I decided to put part of my candy dispenser on my wall. Now, make sure this challenge you have parent supervision because not at, or adult supervision for that matter not everyone is going to want you to tape up the walls. So after my research, I decided to draw my prototype. And in this challenge, because I use the wall, again, you don't have to. You could create a tabletop candy dispenser. For that one, check out the links and the resources that we have in the module. So what I did here was I thought, okay, for my candy to travel, I used just some Solo cups. But if you notice, I can't get any candy through there. So what I did was I actually cut holes into the bottom of the Solo cup. This is where you're going to need adult supervision. To do this, I just made a tiny little slit with scissors. And then I put the scissors in that slit and I cut around this little lip that's there. If you cut all the way around, again, with adult supervision, it should make a hole that you can get your candy through. So I started my dispenser. What's going to happen is the candy will travel through the cups and come down into this cardboard box. What I haven't prototyped yet is usually in a candy machine. I have Skittles, I have mm, peanut butter M&Ms, and regular M&Ms. In an actual candy dispenser, there should be a simple machine that allows me to choose which candy I want to keep the other candies up while the other one drops the candy for me to enjoy. That's the hard part. Well, really, it's not hard because nothing's hard. It's just challenging. So when you're doing your prototypes, be thinking about how you can actually first pick the first different kinds of candies that you love, but also how you can create a machine, a simple machine that'll help you choose which candy that you're going to enjoy, but also how to keep the other candies either up on the wall or on your tabletop design to keep the other two from spilling out when you want the other candy. So for me, as I continue to prototype, I look forward to seeing some of the things that you've done. So make sure to check out the resources on the website. But this one's my favorite because oh, you can eat while you're prototyping. Enjoy.